be brave, okay? I hope there's nothing in there. Obviously the sign says do not feed them food. So now we don't have lunch. Cause if I'm the ocean, you're the rain. We only need each other, baby, you know we're the same. Breakfast is served. Ten thousand years later, we just finished packing. The kids are in the car. I'm wearing my swimming costume as a top because I'm wearing high-waisted shorts, and this is too bright. So maybe I should put you guys over here. The weather is surprisingly pleasant today. Like I was expecting the worst. It's actually pretty perfect. It's pretty toasty. I don't know the exact temperature at this point, but it's it's lovely. I love it. We just finished packing. Dizzy says we must go see the pool. She wants to show us something, so we're gonna go do that quickly, and then we basically checking out it is 11 we tried so damn hard to be out of here before 11 and it's right now 10 42 which means we're gonna be super pressed for time because 10 42 i said we're gonna be there three so 12 1 and then two three about two hours to explore we want to go to we're making the drive to cape of good hope today and we want to go up there and see if it's hike worthy the last time i think we got there and they were already closing i don't remember specifically but i think when we got there they were already like whoops sorry we're closing so we didn't really get in so we'll see everybody's eating chips there's a chips fest in here is it delicious yeah <laughs> buddy basil started it he wasn't even supposed to open his chips and then he just ripped them open. Now everybody wanted chips. Huh, buddy? She's eating ghost pops back there. Uh huh. <sighs> anyway. This is a good a day as any to start the rebuilding of life. The roads that lay open are many When the old one's gone under the knife And I can feel the sun on my skin Beginning to thaw Quick tip you guys, if you wear glasses like me and you forgot your thing to clean the glasses with or it gets dirty, just get a wipe, let it get dry. This thing is amazing, it cleans so well. If we don't eat this, they're gonna eat us. Guys, when you finish this, no more, okay? We all take naps. This is your nap time, basically. The bridge. Uh, there we go. There we go, buddy. Here, babe. I can't reach, so you gotta reach. Uh, mint. Mm -hmm. The only chocolate that matters in the Cadbury line. <laughs> Every time I eat this, I remember how my mom used to buy this many, many months ago when we were still kids. She's the one who got me into mint crisp, basically. Dude has gone into the garage now. And he parked a little too far from the tank. Juicy. But I think she's managing. Juicy. I think she's managing, so we'll see. Cookies. Bow, man, cookies. Protocol is observed. Yum, yum, yum. We have about two hours and 41 minutes to drive, and you gotta do what you gotta do. There's more fish beyond the reef. It definitely, it really does look like Moana's ocean. I love fish water. Point 
chipping it down, put it on your hair. Hair! One little finger, one little finger, one little finger. Tap, tap, tap. Put your finger up. Put your finger down. Put the car. Never felt more like a winner than I do tonight Never more certain the path laid before me was right you guys that's a whole lot of ocean that's a whole lot of ocean that's quite scary look at that you guys a whole lot of ocean we literally just stopped here to do a mini photo shoot <laughs> we had those Jovek people who came up to the coast and we just like stop 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 stop, 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 stop. it looks so pretty look at that yeah Anyway, we are done. Oh, my chair is hot. Yeah. Anyway, an hour and fifty-seven minutes more of driving. So let's go. Where do we go? The lights burn out low. The spring dust the snow. Cause honey, I've been racing the wind like a bird Been chasing the wealth of the world Ooh, every stone I turn I've spoken out every word But it fades with you Time we're here, Kebe was what three years old, yep. a whole three years old, and now here we are with three kids. <laughs> Girl, you've run me to the ground. I have no more money. Here, there you go. Thank you. Can I walk past now? Thank you. Be careful. <laughs> Mesenberg Bay. Uh oh. Hey, buddy. <laughs> Oh, spicy! <laughs> I'm sitting here, Dizzy Basil is actually taking a photo. Look at the kids going up. Um, they want to see what's in those little huts, which I think is so adorable. I don't think there's anything. Well, I hope there's nothing in there. Hold tight, I can save you from misty black waters. Pull you in while you drift away. Hold tight. I can save you from misty black waters Pull you in while you drift away Yeah, you drift away Alright, come here Lolly Nose fell down She scraped her elbow quite badly actually One, two, three, jump! Jump, jump, jump. There we are. Sit down. Let me see elbow. Leg. Oh, baby. Look at that. She slipped on sea sand while she was running. Don't know why she was running, but I need to put a band-aid on there. I need the lips. 
<laughs> you need a wipes. <laughs> I'm telling you guys this mini kit by Dr. Carmen. Find her on Instagram. This stuff is revolutionary, life changing. Seriously, you can take it with you everywhere. It's got just about everything. I was actually supposed to refill our band aids because they've been playing with them. Yeah. Yeah, I might end up using a big, big one. Oh, actually, no. We have some. See? And it's yellow. Here, can you hold it? Thank you. Let's clean this. Be brave, okay? Have it hurt? You're so brave. Mama, huh? let me get a clean. Yes, because Balala fell. Sorry, Balala. Mama said sorry to Balala. I already said sorry to Balala, but again, sorry, Balala. Thank you, Mama. Sorry. Hi, Ki, you're so brave. Sit down, really. Yeah? Mwah. <laughs> Where are you going? I want this. You want to go to your car seat? Can you wait for daddy to help you? Uh -huh. I was at the wrong place at the right time. Because suddenly there you were with those bright blue eyes. We were conversing One for the monster One for the day One for the little boy Who lives down the lane To the night sky When you took my hands and left After true lift hmm? After true lift Okay So we have to go that way Okay All the way to the light All the way to the light Alright. You go down. Uh huh. So, so you go up. See, you go up. Okay. Are we lost? That's the house. Is that the house up there? So, are we still on the right track? Yeah. Okay. Do we have to turn anywhere? Yeah. We, which direction do we turn? Left. Oh. All right. You turn left, driver. Don't wanna be shy. I'm literally shaking. Ah, I need to calm down. Okay, so here's a story. We just got here to Cape Point, right? And we see this baboon, everybody's taking photos, all of that fun stuff. Obviously the sign says do not feed them food, which is fantastic. I mean, we know that, you're not supposed to do that. So anyway, get off the car to go and get Kim's Bunny clothes because she just changed her outfits. Also worried about Nolly Nolls who was taking a nap. So anyway, open the boots and I'm shushing Doozy away. Literally, I'm like, leave the clothes to me. Get the kit. <laughs> As I'm there, this woman starts legit screaming at me, right? And yeah, she's legit just screaming at me. So I turn to my left and sure enough, there's a baboon digging through our boot. I start screaming because I'm just like, what the actual hell? And it took a whole loaf of bread. So now we don't have lunch and we're going to buy chips or KFC or something. We, we already that. passed KFC. I know. Now we haven't got that. It's gone. The, it ran. Ran, ran, ran. But then I was like so mad with that woman for screaming because I just wish she just said, hey, hey, excuse me, or came to me to tap me to say there's a baboon digging into your, your thingy because it wasn't attacking me. It was just there for the food. It just it just made the whole situation worse. And now Buddy was freaking out. It was just the whole show, basically. <laughs> just in case you had doubts. That's available. Yeah. I'm very happy to announce that me and Nolly Nolls have taken a smart decision to just rather stop here. <laughs> I am not going all the way up there. No, on a rope. It is so windy. I literally almost got blown away by the wind literally almost fell over while holding banana because it's that windy we even had
had to put masks on the kiddos so that they can breathe you know so the mask can break the wind so not too much wind goes into them and they end up with stuffy noses in the night so nani nose is wearing my mask peanut is wearing these basils and kb has got her own i got you i got you so yeah Peanut has gone up there with Dizzy Basil. He's freaking out the whole entire way. KB is legit excited. I think we're just gonna make our way down slowly and wait for them down there, basically. She's officially freaking out too. <laughs> Goodness me, look at them. Going down the thing down here. They should come up any second. There they are. <laughs> so brave. So, so brave. Wow, guys. How was the expedition? Very windy or a little windy? Very windy. Extremely. Uh huh. Love castle. Is it a castle? Oh. Where are you going though? Oh. <laughs> wow. See? It's 1635. Oh, yeah. Uh, Mama? Mm. Wait, tell you that it's closed though so that the, the balloons don't see the money. The drinks? Yeah, home guy was ready to go open the I mean our bread. Our lunch is gone because oh, I opened the boot. I was doing the Mama, GPS. Let's go. Mommy, what's our bread? The baboon took our bread sweet tart. A now we have nothing to A whole loaf, bruh. A whole loaf. Now we have nothing to eat. We have to kind of go find food at this point. Yeah. There's no going back. No going back. There's no going back to your own life. No living in the past. I'm feeling here tonight, riding on the dizzying heights. Sunsets, remember the colors They were wrong, it was way more than a dream We climbed up, yeah, over the hillside It's alright, we stood there all wide-eyed You and I, floating on air in my mind Cause there's no going back, no going back There's no going back to your own like this a lot like it like it like it look at the kitchen bedroom one Ooh. whoa honey you've got to see this this is the main bedroom there's lots and lots and lots of stairs so yes. you guys be super careful Yo, look at this. right oh my gosh there's a tv do not throw yourself on there it is slightly chilly in here. Go sit down there on the couch. I need to figure out where. Trent Channel's in the second bedroom. Okay. Go sit down. So many plugs, yeah? Okay. They say you change the channels in the bedroom. <laughs> I think the heaters might only just be in the bedrooms. So. I'm gonna give them a head start and put that on so that everybody sleeps nice and toasty. The kids are apparently all settled in here, which is fantastic, but it's still cold. I managed to put on the heaters in the two bedrooms where we're gonna sleep, which is great. I think I'm gonna end up asking Lisa to bring the gas cylinder in here so we can do our own heater. Because it's cold in here, huh? The kids have discovered that the second bedroom actually has a TV, so they basically gone camping in there. <laughs> no complaints though. And I'm almost done cooking. I'm just waiting for the rice to finish cooking. The whole house smells so good. I'm literally just making rice and lucky stuff, but it smells so good and it's warm now. I'm starting to think maybe I, I kind of sort of overreacted with the whole bring the heater thing. I want to sort out the footage that I have because right now my mind is all over the show. I don't know what I have, what I don't. And my editing backlog is insane. I want to see. It was so windy. When Peanut was just two months old, we came to visit Gabby. 
I like the microphone. I must say, I love, love, love the microphone because this clip was filmed in super windy conditions, super windy, and all you hear is just me and a little bit of wind in the background, but mostly just me. Dizzy Basil is basically unpacking everything from the car. We just need to sort through stuff. And there's a washing machine here. A big part of me is like, maybe just wash everything, hang it. They even gave us washing powder. But what if they don't get dry tomorrow? We have to check out here by 10. What if they're not dry? That's kind of giving me a, a pause moment. But I, I do know that it would be a grand idea because Lord knows. Maybe just the warm clothes because I didn't pack a lot of that and we've used them up pretty much at the beginning of the trip because Dragon's Back was pretty chilly and then and George was raining and cold. PE was cold, but let me hear what the husband thinks. Mama. Mama. Hi. Mama. Yeah? Mama. Careful, wow. What is it? What is it, Lola? Mama, Daddy. Mama, Daddy. Oh, Daddy figured it out for you guys? Oh, you did it? Mama. Huh? You want a cup? Uh -huh. Where are you going? Come on then, buddy. Evelyn, you have to walk slowly. Uh, wow. Don't spill, don't spill, don't spill, don't spill, don't spill. <laughs> He's laughing. He's giving me a very full question and he laughs. Tonight we're running on the right track.